This is the video you've all been waiting for. Over 10 years of zombie story in one video. What's going on everyone? My name is Mr. Dalek JD and welcome to the Call of Duty Zombies movie. I compiled all of the trailers, cutscenes and cinematics into one video. That's over 10 years of zombies action in one video. If you're new to the channel, feel free to subscribe for more zombies videos. And if you've ever played Call of Duty Zombies, then leave a like rating and let me know in the comments your favorite maps and memories. Thank you and enjoy. Do not stand still. Change is the law of life, and those who look only to the past or the present are certain to miss the future. I said, are certain to miss the future. <laughs> oh no, I missed that. Prime Minister Castro, this missile crisis was the last straw. We almost blew ourselves up. Now we invited you here today. In good faith. In good faith, to sort this thing out. And why is he here? He lost. As I always say, forgive your enemies, but remember their names. Now, gentlemen, as I like to think in the long history of the world, that there are only a few generations. Sounds like someone breaking in. It's just a storm, Dick. Sit down. Oh, my God! It appears the Pentagon has been breached. Zombies. Gentlemen, at times like these, our capacity to retaliate must be, and has to be massive, to deter all forms of aggression. Gentlemen, lock and load. Viva la revolución! Any last words, Mr. President? Yes, Jack. Any superlative words of inspiration for our humble troops? Do not pray for easy lives, my friends. Pray to be stronger men. Well, I've always liked the monster within idea. I like the zombies being us. It's like zombies are the blue collar monsters. We're completely surrounded! We're completely fucked! Are you girls kidding me? I've been praying for this shit! Come on! Boys, let's get to work. For God's sakes, he missed me again! <sighs> oh, cut! Are you blind, man? Like this. Mm. Ow! Oh. See? No, Hefe, I do it like this. Daddy! 
I'd do it like this. Get back to hair and makeup. You don't look dead enough. Come on, let's go. That ain't in the script. We're writing a new one. It's called Shag Shack Massacre. This is a real nightmare. Let's slay some stiffs. Years ago, I did research for a World War II movie. I came across some old Nazi documents. I couldn't believe what I was reading. Element 115, necromancers, raising the dead, real creepy stuff. We're completely surrounded! Come on! The coolest thing? Some of that crazy shit happened right here. I don't understand. Why are you doing this? Why me? Travel where? Don't you get it? There's nothing left! How did you... What? What do you mean, mend the rift? Well, maybe I don't wanna? Huh? Did you think of that? Oh, you can't tell them about the flesh! What I did, they'd kill me if they knew! Ah, oh, shit! If you're gonna talk to your imaginary friends, Stu, you might want to wait till you're in a Z-free zone! Stupider! Get over here, now! Come on, come on! What do we do now? We arm up, find a good place to defend, kick ass, that's it. I don't understand. What are you talking about, Stuinger? Misty made it pretty clear. Except for fate, begin a new. We're going down. We're going down. Fight. Now! Have we been here before? They all look at you the same way, don't they, Al? They see a weasel or a rat. You're a survivor, Al. No shame in that. Even a rat survives. You can take it, whatever they throw you away. You killed before, Finn, but it was always business. Not this time, no pal. You know what greed could do. They'll fight like rats. This is all just a game, isn't it? A big, twisted, fucked up game. You know the answer to that. I can't change the past. I wish I could, but I just can't. Am I stuck here until I see the error of my ways? Until I repent? Or you're gonna have to wait a long time! Because I don't regret a damn thing! It can't be like this forever. There has to be a way to break the cycle. Either wake me up, or just fucking kill me already! What did I do wrong? How do I put things right? Kill me! Kill me right here! Right now! I'm not afraid to die! What's the matter? You can't escape your own guilt? Do you feel it? Deep down? Nagging? Eating away at you? Is that really what you want? What do you think will be waiting for you when you get out, Sal? 
You think the city will be just as you left it? Enough walking for today. We set up camp here. In case you boneheads have forgotten, the world is broken. Very broken. The dead walk the earth. And what remains of civilization is at the mercy of forces we barely understand. What makes you think we're gonna find something different at this new place? I don't know that we will. But at least we'll be sure. Uh, sure of what, exactly? I don't know. His memory's going again. Your name is Russman. Russ Man. That my first or last name? We don't know. You're just Russman. Yeah, anyway, you're a former operative from Broken Arrow. You've been walking the Earth since the, uh, <clears throat> incident. Yeah. I think I remember. The town. That's right! That's where you found us! When we met, you already had your lapdog in tow. What do you mean, lapdog, huh? I'm the only one who knows what to do! Don't talk stupid, Stu. All you know is whatever the German tells you to think. I don't think you're in any position to ridicule Mr. Stuhlinger, particularly given your own proclivities. You better watch your mouth before you say something you regret, boy. Enough! We need to remember why we're here. We've all been jumping through hoops for reasons we don't fully understand. Fully understand? All right, for reasons we don't understand at all. Point is, we do it. We keep moving, we keep fighting. It's what we do, day in, day out. If you really need a reason why we do this, I'll give you one. We do it because doing something, anything, is better than doing nothing. The rift is less than one day's travel. We move at dawn. What if we don't find answers? Then we'll just have to ask more questions. In the solemn field of silence, I can barely feel the pain. It begins again in mystery, and I always stand up there, always unsuspecting, so easy to learn. Even 
death is no escape. You are dead already! began long ago, on the battlefields of the Great War. Two German scientists sought to harness dark and mysterious forces buried for centuries. They believed their discoveries would assure Germany's ultimate victory. What they could never have imagined was just what else their research would unearth. evil ravaged the front lines, the hopes of the Allies rested on three soldiers sent to stop it. My name is Samantha. I'm going to tell you how all this really began. As the gates to Agartha opened, the four heroes were rewarded with riches beyond imagination. From that day forward, they knew that Samantha would keep them safe forever. <sighs> Getting everything wrong. I told you before, their eyes should be blue. It's my turn, Eddie. I can do whatever I want. But you don't even know how to play properly. Girls don't know enough about zombies. What's the choice of a shooter? Make sure the windows are locked before you come down to the basement. You'd better do what your dad says. I didn't even get my turn. 
tomorrow, Eddie. You get to make the rules. I promise. Come on, Fluffy. I wish the heroes in our stories were real, Sam. I know what you mean. But we will make everything okay. My dad says he has a plan. I'm so sorry. I really don't have time to explain. I have a universe to set right. Thank you and goodbye. wasn't how it was supposed to go. We were supposed to secure the package and be in and out clean. Instead, the whole thing's been one disaster after another. Eat my blade, beast! Ah, fucking move, maggot addicts! Today, you die! Four, three, First, I took your legs! Now, I take two, your life! The road is long and dark, but I know where we are going. I... We... will complete our mission. I know you have questions, but you have to trust me. I have seen things you wouldn't believe. Things you couldn't even imagine. Richtofen claims knowledge of worlds beyond this realm. Do you believe this is possible? for my soul. supposed to go. We were supposed to secure the package and be in and out clean. Instead, the whole thing's been one disaster after another. I should never have trusted you, Richthofen. Never! You should trust me, Dempsey. You all should. 
This artifact has the power to contain and preserve the subject's soul. Your soul. But it can only be done after the moment of death. Just as you saw me do to my other self. It is the only way. Wait! If someone's gotta take him out to save the universe, then it should be me that does it. Good to see you, Tank.
corrupted, consumed by evil. I did not believe I would find you in such a place. I was a warrior. I fought many great battles for the glory of our nation. For the honor of the dying samurai spirit. I was a hero. I share this memory. I have lived many of the same victories. I later learned that my victories were unwelcome. His betrayal was driven by petty jealousy. He knew I could endure anything, that I feared not even my own death. Punishment is one thing. This is cruelty. Who could be so evil? as to desire another soul to endure such suffering. Who amongst us could be so dishonorable? Are you so blinded by your own loyalty? The orders came from the Emperor himself. My life, my path, is built upon a lie. This realm may have been corrupted and consumed by evil, but we possess the power to change things. A better tomorrow is only possible if we blow away the ashes of the past. None of us choose the means by which mercy will find us. But I am at peace. I understand what must be done. Will you be my Kaishakunin? It is my honor.
I am sorry, Nikolai. I wish... I wish there was another way. But know this. In my heart, I share the same pain as you. The pain that you have buried and blurred beneath an alcohol-fueled haze. Yes. The pain of your memory. You loved and you lost. Everything else has been delusional fantasy that distance you from painful truth. You know what I speak of. You remember. Before the bombs fell. Before she was... taken from us. Some things are forgotten. For a reason! <laughs> It is done. The souls have been collected, Maxis. We will see you soon. It is said that it is better to have loved and lost than never to have loved at all. I feel differently. Regret can consume a man so deeply that it will blacken his heart and swallow his soul. For so long we have been fighting. Many battles, many wars. I lost only one. We have seen impossible things, cheated death countless times. I can no longer deny the possibility of an unseen power, a guiding hand helping us to fulfill our destiny. My path is chosen, our fate is sealed. But the innocent, the children, those untainted by darkness and chaos, they can find a better tomorrow. My name is Edward Richthofen, and I have been trying so very hard to do the right thing. Long ago, I made a promise a vow to protect him. In order to keep my word, I have done bad things. Very bad things. I do not regret the pain that I have caused, because none of it really matters. This moment, this me. All of it will soon be gone. I have lied. I have cheated. I have deceived, all for a purpose you could never understand. I would not change a single thing. He thinks I do not know, but I do. The blood will protect me. can be a cruel mistress. In its relentless march forward, it robs each of us of many things. Moments, experiences, people. Time can take them all from us in an instant. Such things are gone forever unless they live on within our hearts, our minds, our memories. For all is cruelty, time can also be a great teacher 
through the changes left behind in its wake, we can learn, we can grow, we can come to understand those truths that have eluded us in the past. Only then can we truly understand ourselves. Field report. Final entry. Oh, well, this is it. The end game. I know what I have to do. Richtofen's barely holding it together. I've got to believe he can go the extra mile. None of us really know how this is going to play out. But we all know it's the only way forward. hope that our souls may find a better future. This is it. The ether. The infinite. The reality beyond. Beyond the world you know. Beyond your perception. Things are going to get a lot worse before they get better. You change the rules. There are certain things that you can't ever change. All I ask is that you do the right thing. The right thing for everyone. Unimaginable evil manifests all around us. So much of the past has returned. But what of our future? We put our fates in the hands of a madman. Truly, we have reaped what we have sown. Mein Gott! What have I done? It's stopping it, but breathe. Marxist! We'll fight side by side, back to back. Even if it's for the last time. Shadows are gathering. A storm is rising. Events, long foretold, will soon come to pass. But I feel at peace, as though some burden has been lifted. I will find a new path. The snow falls heavy, storm clouds gather. I fear we will soon succumb to madness and delusion. Some things are forgotten. For a reason! Richthofen, for all his sins. Good to see you, Tank. He was the one who showed me just how blind I had been. I thank him for that. I wish... I wish there was another way. still avert disaster. We can still set things right. It is the only way. I don't think this is a dream. There's no easy way out for any of us. He told us right from the start. We bear the mark. We are cursed. I'm so sorry. I really don't have time to explain. I have a universe to set right. Thank you. And goodbye. No mortal could hope to achieve victory against such evil. This I know deep in my heart. 
I will fight until there are no more battles to be won. I will make this right. With or without the help of Dr. Monty. Our complete assimilation of this dimension will now proceed. Everything has led to this moment. Destiny is not on your side. All right, you shadow fuck. Let's end this. Once and for all. Destroy him! End it! With the evil vanquished, I can start making it all nice again. No undead, no apothecans, no shadow man. All of it gone. Forever. But it, here's the funny thing. You snowflakes shouldn't even still be here. You should be fading out of existence by now. Those blood vials. I was wondering when you'd bring this up. They're from realities we've already closed off. They shouldn't be here. They can't be here. Such a paradox means you're putting my perfect world at risk. You guys and your bloody free will. What to do? What to do? Well, you certainly can't stay here. You could send us somewhere else. Somewhere we've never been. Hmm. I suppose I could make a little corner somewhere in history. A place where I can dump some of the other shit that I've left over, or I just wipe you from existence. Ooh, hang on. Actually, that all works out perfectly.
way. I'm impossible. My God, what? You belong to me. Uh, my brain trying to escape my skull. Escape? Nine. It isn't true. <sighs> sir, yes, sir. Another step in the master plan, eh, Richtofen? You lead, we follow. All works out in the end, am I right? <sighs> Fucking A, right. This is just a locked in a cell in the tenth level of hell part of Richtofen's grand scheme. <laughs> Mine grand scheme? And what if I told you we were doomed from the start? That every word in that infernal book has come to pass, and we have been helpless to alter it. What would you have done, Marine? Tell me, please, what was the right thing to do? Garbage heap is your magnum opus. I applaud your dedication, Herr Warden, but your Armageddon is locked in here with you. Until you brought me the key, I can hear it pounding through your veins. <laughs> faster and faster! So, your life sentence begins. You will suffer. You will not die. Your heart will beat as everlasting engines in my machine, holding the gateway open so that he, they, will finally be free. Now rest yourselves. Soon we begin. Lights out! Sing. They are free of this realm. Ain't that swell? Does that mean we win? I would be greatly relieved if that were so. I am in no hurry to ensnare my mortal soul. That will not be necessary, Nikolai. The future has changed. Look, 
Draenorian. Read it. Learn of your true calling. You must keep your soul. It will be needed to defeat Dr. Monty. Who? Hello? Hello? I, I am still here. Wait! I honestly thought you were going, going to let me bleed to death. It was so sad. The cycle is broken, Herr Doctor. As such, insurance policies are no longer needed. I wish I could tell you I was sorry, Edward. But I'm not. No! No, you can help me! You're a doctor! Wait! Don't you know who I am? I have been witness to miracles and calamities! Dimensions born and collapse! I walk a path no other can take! No! I want to be me. Someone who did all the hard work! I wanted to keep going. This is me. Most faces are. You won't even remember.
will teleport to Vodka Factory. <laughs> Understand the earth. We saw it destroyed. Yet here we are. It's more time travel bullshit, Tech. It just hasn't happened yet. Speaking of BS. How the hell did you get back in your body, Doc? <laughs> Does it matter, Dempsey? I'll tell you what matter. Americans still give Nikolai his vodka. Is that your plan, Nikolai? To give up and drink yourself to oblivion? Or do you want to make a difference for once in your life? You. Oh, Shiza. You four must come with us. In time, it will make sense. But now... Intruders on the base. Hacker full. Now we must go. Quickly. There is a war to be fought. War? What kind of war? A war unlike any you have ever seen. The Great. A little learning is a dangerous thing. Drink deep, or taste not the Pierian spring. So goes the poem. I understand its meaning. I have drunk so deeply that my every fiber aches with the pain of what has been. And the pain of what has yet to come. I fear it may drive me insane. phase of our journey. I wish I could forewarn you of what is to come, and what is at stake. Show them no mercy! There is more to this facility than meets the eye. Primary systems offline. Get down! Do you really think you could contain me? Happy, Nikolai? Everything playing out as the Chronorium predicted. We have what we came for. The Elemental Shard. Hooray for us! No. It's too late! Maxis? Doing. 
Who knows? Who does he speak of? Dr. Monty. What's happening, Nikolai? You are too late. That's all we fucking need. Hello, Samantha. Who is the boy? Uh, that would be us. We're going to fight the war, Eddie. The great war. Then, we're going back to the house to kill him and burn it all to the ground. Agartha, the ether, the infinite. Everything. Serious? No way! Dude, that's awesome! Uh, Stu? Oh my. Someone's been busy. Your enjoyment pal asked if we wanted to live. This don't feel like living. Blech. Calm down, everybody. Everything's fine. Or, or going to be fine. Okay? My friends, old and new, we stand on the brink of victory. Element 115, Group 935, the Helpic Scourge, the MPD, the Apothecals, all of it will soon be gone. But tonight, tonight we celebrate. Some maggot feeders headed downstairs, and we ain't got no weapons. Yes, I'm telling them now, but they're all a teasy bit grumpy because they just woke up. Hey, Stu, you want to be a bit more specific about what the voice in your head is actually saying? Dr. Minty, what is he like a bad guy? With this power, and the means to control it, we can go wherever we choose. At last, we can return to our homes, our old lives, our families. I've gotta be honest with you, Samuel. I don't have even the slightest inkling as to what an Agarthan device is. He didn't say you had to know what it was, Martin. Just how to build it. Trust me, guys. It won't be that complicated. In fact, my German pal says it's gonna be a schlomp dunk. It's one thing trusting you, Stu. It's a whole other thing trusting your imaginary brain buddy. Oh, Rusman, how can you even say that? He's the sweetest guy in the whole universe. He wants us to help save it. The universe! Thank you, Sammy. I'm moved.
madness is nearly over, child. But one thing remains. The one who perpetuates this madness. He must be... I wish I did not have to ask this of you, but... Only you can do it. I think I understand. I know why I am here. Of course this would happen to us! Calm down! The madness is nearly over, but one thing remains. Comrades! As we toast our victory, I want each of you to think about what you really want. Where would you like to go now? Believe me, you can have it. Multiverse must come to an end. The paradox must be resolved. At least, it will be quick. the chapters of our lives, good and bad. Even if there was no witness, even if no one cared to see, it still happened somewhere. We fought the great war over and over, but victory could never be ours. We were always doomed to fail. Monty told us the truth. Our journey is the very reason this madness exists. We are the ones who fractured the universe. This is the truth the Cronorium showed me. The truth Richtofen could no longer face. When we are gone, so too is everything that spewed forth from the ether. Element 115, the Apothecons, even Monty himself, 
all of it will be banished to where it belongs. The Dark Aether. We should not be here. Our time has passed. But for all the pain and torment we have endured together, as we leave this life behind, it is my hope that you know one thing beyond any doubt. Away, Eddie. You are more than just my allies, my brothers in arms. You were my friends. I would like to return to my home, my beloved, before the bombs fell, if only to die by her side. I see myself at peace, serene, sitting beneath a cherry blossom tree, listening to the joy of my children at play. I think I'd like to teach medicine, maybe pathology. You know, the more I think about it, the more I think I'd be a darn good DI. <laughs> Get those kids toughened up. I would like to be in favorite bar, but as long as I have vodka, I am happy man. I would like to know for sure that I brought honor to my ancestors and the Emperor. I should probably try to relax, take up a hobby. Maybe I could open my own morgue. Let me think about it. Wherever I go, you know I'll be kicking ass.
What have you done? Did you get the package? We've lost two teams since you went dark. Old war footage is the last thing on my mind right now. Watch it. Watch the tape. Then tell me I'm wrong. How did you get hold of this? A friend in the KGB. A late friend. Germans have Russian friends? Yeah, some of us do. What the hell is that? That is why you needed to see the tape. The machine. shot one week later. It's a cleanup crew. Poor bastards. Tried to bury it. And it stayed buried until two weeks ago. Now it's happening again. Have you heard of the Omega Group? You have to turn yourself in. The CIA can protect you. I can protect you. I can't do that, Weaver. The Omega Group have plans for the outbreak zones. I have to stay in the field. Sam, please! I'm sorry. This is the only way. 